Drama Llama, go! Happy Llama, Sad Llama, Mentally Disturbed Llama, Super Llama, Drama Llama, Big Fat... Hey everyone, I'm just llama. making this video to say I am really, really sorry for the way that the last alive ended. Um, the truth is, um, and I'm just gonna tell you the truth, and it's exactly what I told my Patreons. I, I really needed an hour or so to, like, cool off. I went live about five hours ago on my second channel, you know, to talk about, you know, funny things, blah, blah, blah. I didn't even know about this. story about Iqmal and Ryan of Church. I really didn't know anything. So here on my second channel, which we don't talk about true crime stories at all, someone managed to kind of insert me into that story. And oh, you gotta watch this video. You gotta watch this video. What do you gotta watch? You gotta watch Ryan of Church's video. And I'm just gonna like, okay, stutter on stand. So Ryan of Church ends up taking a link. I let him on. I let everybody else go. The reason I left... Okay, I know. Oh! You didn't say goodbye to them. I'm sorry I didn't say goodbye to them. I'm sorry. He came up. I was still trying to get on. Let the man talk. I invited Ikmel up. I had no idea what he was talking about. Then the more I started talking to him, I was like, oh, shit. For real? I'm sitting there like, oh my goodness. I look over in the chat. I got a, uh, I got a mod that's going crazy on anyone that said anything bad about Mel. And I got all these, everyone's going nuts. Half of them love Mel. Half of them hate, hate Mel. Half of them love Ryan up church. Half of them hate us. So I'm like, so I'm sitting in my own lane and I'm listening. And I'm, I'm honestly feeling like there's nothing that this guy could possibly tell me that's going to make me believe <laughs> that Igmel is doing this. And I know that I said that. But still, it's alright. I flip out at the end. Oh! I see this bitch in the chat gives me $2 super chat. Take your fucking $2 the fuck out of here. Oh, you weren't loyal to Igmel. Oh, I'm sorry. What did you expect from someone who doesn't know anything what's going on? And Ikmel was invited to come up. He said he was going to go live on his own channel. And respect that. Fine. Plus, this is not my business. He's made it my business. I, I kind of felt it like I was set up. And I wasn't ready for, like, to be shocked. Or drama. And for me to start yelling. I, I just wasn't in that mindset. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm so tired, you know. So then, after that whole debacle, we find out that Kylie Rodney is found. So then I start getting pissed off at that Samantha chick. And sadly, you know, the story that Justin's covering finally... You know, she's found. I can't imagine. Now, I really didn't, I didn't do the Kylie story. Did I, did I comment on it? Yeah. But it's not my story to tell. And it's not something that I was much invested with. Was I wondering what the hell is this girl? Absolutely. But I definitely think, did not think that she was locked in Igmel's basement. I was like, what? I was not expecting him to go there. I wasn't. I'm sorry. So then, you know, I, I, I know that I, re I remember asking my dear friend Justin, Hey, I'm, you want to take this over to your uh, channel? No, it's okay. So I'm trying to like, process everything that's going on. And I failed. <laughs> and I'm, I'm getting really, really like... 
like my wheels are, are going and I just knew anything 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 little was gonna set me off and a bunch of women came up Pam Ridner came up I was excited to talk to her and there was a woman that was talking I don't remember what she was talking about she was talking and she was talking and she was talking and then I heard her say that her son had relapsed and then the son relapsed again and I'm going, oh my god, how do we get here? How do we get here? We gotta stay on topic. Me and Justin said that we were gonna have this thing that we were gonna have everybody stay on topic. And I just flipped out. And I honestly did not hear her say that she lost her child. I didn't even hear that. Because if I did hear it, I would have said, oh my god, that's terrible. So I flipped out. And I kicked off the panel. And Justin's like, she lost her son. And I'm like, ah, I gotta go. <laughs> it's not funny, but psh, whatever. I'm sorry. There's just so much that I can handle, especially when there's a time and a place for everything. Especially when you are not prepared. I was not prepared for anything that happened today on live. You know what? I should have just stayed in my bed and watched War of the Worlds on repeat. That's what I should have just did. And I did it. So, I'd, I'd never seen this lady before in my chat before. I think her name was Sylvia McMillan. Sylvia. Juanita McMillan. Juanita McMillan, if you're listening to this video, I am sorry. I'm sorry I cut you off. I'm sorry that I made myself look bad. My intention was not to make you look bad. It was me losing control maybe i need anger management um i don't know <clears throat> but I'm, I'm i'm just so tired of hearing all this bad stuff well maybe you shouldn't do true crime you're right i know i shouldn't i know i shouldn't so juanita mcmillan please accept my apology thank you so much and everyone oh my god we got another mandingo calling god almighty and I'm not even in the mood for it. So you want to know something? I could go live on my second ch channel and go off on every single man dingo that calls me. Because I'm going to be like, you know what? I'm here to tell you about yourself. Anyway, thank you guys for tuning in. And Laura, I heard you were streaming me. You need to get a life. Your channel's dead. Give it up. God almighty. You're such a loser. It's pathetic. Dude. Maybe if you stop being such a phony, people would respect you, but they don't. Old washed up. Ugh, God, man. You're not even worth it. But anyway, yeah, that that is a very sincere apology to Miss Juanita McMillan. I am so sorry about your story, and I should have let you finish, and I should not have uh, just been so frustrated. I was just very frustrated. It was a lot to take on in a very very short time and that's the truth and if you want to accept my apology wonderful great i appreciate that if you don't there's nothing i can do and that's the apology i'm going to give to everybody that was watching thank you so much Mama Lama 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 Who is this big llama starting all this drama It's me baby.